ERC. The IBCLC certification, which stands for International Board Certified Lactation Consultant, is the highest certification within breastfeeding support. What is the problem? The IBCLC profession is predominantly white. Take a look at these statistics. Only 10.8% of IBCLCs are black, 8.6% are Latinx, 7.8% are Asian, and only 0.3% are American Indian and Alaska Native. Why is it important to level the playing field? We can talk for days on this subject, but to name a few, we have systemic bias, systemic racism, and good old culture. It is clear in everyday life and in the literature that systemic bias and racism are very real. One thing we can do is increase the number of people of color within the healthcare system. And culture, culture affects communication. People have different styles and language to which they communicate within their communities and within their cultures. This can be huge when you're working with families. People want to be understood. So what's the next problem? Obtaining the IBCLC credential is confusing and expensive. We're required to take 14 college courses, which if you have a financial barrier, you have the option of getting aid. Then there's the 95 hours of lactation specific courses, which costs about $1,000. Then comes the clinical program. If you are getting credentialed under something called Pathway 3, you have to one, find a place to get those clinical hours, and two, pay for them. And you need 500 clinical hours in total. There are not a lot of programs out there where you can easily find hours. We have three mentees who had to temporarily relocate to our area because it's so impossible to find programs. The BRC has a thriving mentorship program as we not only work with families once they're home, but we also co are contracted by two local hospitals to provide all the lactation support. This gives our mentees a very well-rounded experience. We obtained one grant for this scholarship two years ago and have decided to make this a sponsorship opportunity. I'll let you hear straight from Janae, who was the recipient of this scholarship. I started my journey to become a lactation consultant last year, and I was very excited about one of the biggest barriers to becoming a consultant was getting the required hours. It took me moving to another state to find a place that offered the clinical hours that I needed. Another barrier was paying for the program. As a result, many aspiring lactation consultants are unable to become IBCLCs. I was fortunate enough to contact the Breastfeeding Resource Center. The executive director and founder of the BRC, Colette Acker, was offering a clinical program at a reduced rate for persons of color, but it was still difficult to come up with the funds. One day, I received a call from Colette saying that I was covered by a grant. The grant covered a person of color who lived in Delaware County, which fit my description perfectly. I was super excited and uh, grateful. Um, I just want to thank those who funded the grant and for Colette who worked hard to acquire it. 